I'm stopped on a point here on Little Cork Lake. I'm not going to be doing extensive paddling in Little Cork today. That's not why I came here. I just wanted to make sure I could get here and I just wanted to have a little bit of a look. Uh, if we do come here for a fall trip, it, you know, I didn't want to explore the whole area, you know what I mean? I want it to be uh, something new for both of us if, we, if my brother does come. There's a small island out there I can see. Right there. It's a fairly level island. Small though. But there's a lot of trees on it. Uh, there are other islands here. Um, I think there's more down that way. I can't really tell now because the islands, they blend in against the background. Bit of wind picking up. Uh, I knew, I, I did check the wind forecast before I came today and it's gonna increase to about 20 kilometers per hour. You know, I, like I said, I'm not going too far today. I'm just gonna, this is as far as, oh, there's some stuff here. See that? It's a, it's a chimney and it's probably a chimney off of a, an ice hut, possibly. Well, anyways, because they can get in here in the winter time to ice fish. Uh, they, they use the trail and they use snowmobiles to get in here. So, uh, and I have come in here from, uh, I think it's from that shoreline. If you look over on that shoreline, let's just zoom in on there. Along that shoreline, there's all kinds of that smooth rock shoreline there. Uh, you see the way it is? It's smooth rock all the way along there. Could be a bit difficult to land on, but I'm sure there are some lower areas that uh, you can sneak ashore on. Yeah, but we'll leave that mystery unsolved for now because, like I said, I'm I'm just happy I got in here and uh, I had a little bit of a look around. It's a nice lake, nice wilderness lake. Nobody around, it's quiet as anything. So, yeah, mission accomplished. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be that easy. I mean, I did have that one beaver dam, was a bit tricky, but. Uh, and I got a bit wet, but uh, that was the only obstacle. So I'm going to be paddling back along the same shoreline now until they reach that river. And I'm going to paddle back up the river and haul my stuff back up to the truck. <laughs> but I'm not in any hurry, you know. A bit of wind, you know, the wind is picking up and uh, that makes things a bit more difficult. But anyways. Let's get going.